imagine spending your life being bullied or avoided by others all because you smell terrible. Fortunately, it's reality for one in 10,000 people worldwide due to a medical condition. WTXL's Christina Resnack raises awareness on this rare disorder. When Lisa Merdis was a child, her classmates constantly picked on her. Uh, after school, the kids would pour washing powder on me. As an adult, the bullying didn't stop. At work, I was harassed. I was um, sprayed with perfume. Unemployment, homelessness, and depression, all because of a medical condition she can't control. It's called trimethylaminuria, or TMAU. It happens when a person's body can't break down the chemical TMA, causing a strong body odor that no amount of soap or body spray can cover up. It's extremely strong, um, very volatile. It could fill up a room in a matter of seconds just from breathing through your nose without even speaking. Some sufferers describe their scent as fishy, a reason TMAU has earned the nickname fish odor syndrome. Others say they smell like garbage, rotten eggs, or even burnt rubber. What happens is there are other chemicals in the body. It's like any fragrance, if you put some perfume on your skin, it might smell a little different on the different people. Because of the strong body odor, people with TMAU can't enjoy things that may seem part of everyday life for other people, like going to the movies with friends. I couldn't really enjoy that because my focus would be on, you know, people's reactions to me. Maria De La Torre has had TMAU since birth, and when her son showed symptoms of the genetic disorder, she decided to take action. I started the, this company with uh, the idea of trying to unite researchers, experts, um, and sufferers so that we could um, try to work together. Maria founded Mebo Research in her hometown of Miami. The public charity aims to unite sufferers, promote awareness, and fund research programs. I realized there is some information in the computer, I just didn't know where to look, and that there was a tremendous need to bring all this information together. Since it was founded, Mebo has provided a safe haven for sufferers of TMAU to come together and support each other from all over the world. For people like Lisa, it's a place for her to spread her message of hope. I'm here to let you know that you're a beautiful person and unique and never give up because there is hope out there. To learn more about TMAU and find out how you can help people with this rare condition, visit our website at WTXL.TV. Christina Resnack, WTXL, ABC 27, dedicated to you. Beautiful and unique, no matter what you're suffering from. She's got that right. Indeed. All right, we're dealing with...